Hi, I'm a Slurpee. So, I was in this room, and Bogey Minsend... Oh, I guess it, I guess he's not Bogey. He's 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 Groggy or whatever his name was. It it was Groggy, right? Yeah, that's why his cap has a G on it, because it's supposed to be like, oh, he's actually Groggy, uh, the one we met in Jabu's belly many many years ago, uh, and he said that he he hid a Jiggy underneath the bed. I didn't think. He meant this bed because he said his bed and I'm like well this clearly is not his bed he's just in this room or whatever but I thought okay well you know what I tried to get underneath the bed I couldn't do it so then I went back I turned into this little uh, slurpy thing oh my god I know what that was steam was like oh you're using the PS4 controller I'm like yes I am thanks steam well let me get back to my explanation so I, I went back and got the Slurpee, I brought him all the way up here, and, uh... Surprise, surprise. You can't get underneath- you cannot get underneath here with Banjo and Kazooie. Looks like you can only get underneath here as a, uh... As a snow cone. So that's one Ziggy down. Uh, yeah, I, I don't know. That that, that, that was kind of weird, because we know he said, Oh, I hid a Ziggy under my bed. But couldn't he have said... Like, couldn't he have said, I hid a Ziggy under the bed in this room? That would have been a lot more easier. Because here I was thinking, Do I have to go back to Jabu Jabu and uh, look under his bed or something? Like, no, that doesn't make any sense. But, oh well, that's just kind of how it goes. Luckily, I did think about, luckily I did go back and turn to uh, Celestia on my own. So, uh, just had the hunts, and uh, I was I was correct. Now, was that Jiggy under there the whole time? I don't know. I don't know if it was. Um, there is one place here I, I want to check out. Because we are missing one more Jiggy, and I realized that there was one place that we haven't actually looked at. And that was... At the very top of this castle. So th this castle is pretty massive. I, I really really like the, like the, the, the design of it. But you know, I, I never got up farther than her face. So like, is there anything on top of the hat or anything? Out of all the Jiggies in the game, this is probably one of the most simplest ones to get. It's just fly to the top of Grunty's hat and get the Jiggy. We did it! As the thunder strikes in the background. The final Jiggy dance of the game. Oh my god, we did it. We got everything. Even after I said, oh, I don't know, guys, I don't know if I'm going to 100% the game. Yeah, well, guess what? The game was good enough to deserve it. The game, oh, look, like, that's how high is like, I can't go any higher. Yeah, that, that's the height limit. Okay, that makes sense. Yeah, the game was definitely good enough to warrant it. Now, here's, here, here's one more thing I want to check out. Um, I just want to look at one more thing. Uh, I want to see where that door leads in uh, the warp room, because that was a pretty high note amount, so I want to see where that leads. So, you know, let's travel back to the past, and uh, we'll figure out where that, where that door leads to. Oh, back to where it all started. One last time. So yeah, there's this one. The 882. 
I don't know. I don't know if this is in game. I don't know if this is like post game thing. It kind of looks like it might be, but uh, you know, let's just go ahead and check it out. I want to see what's behind door number eight eighty two. Oh. What is this? Oh, Easter eggs. The list of Easter eggs in every single part of the game. That's kind of cool. I'm glad I'm glad I didn't save this for last because that this would be really weird. All right, what does that say? Games, consoles, plus games, Nintendo characters, 007 characters, and other. Well, that was a perfect dark thing in uh, Zora's Domain. It was a 007 thing in Zora's... Oh! Wait. I don't know. I don't know what that was. Oh, Gulf, Gulf War Game Boy. That's what I was thinking of. Okay, yeah. Alright, shut up again. We already heard this line of dialogue. That's the Game Boy I was thinking of. That's the Game Boy that survived a bombing or whatever. And and uh, it still works. That that's that was the Gulf War Game Boy. Okay. Well, that's cool. Okay, nice. I'm uh, I'm pretty happy that he adds this little checklist so you can kind of figure out what you've seen or what you haven't seen or just kind of like that. So that's pretty neat. Um. But, you know, luckily, we can just head right back into Grunty's castle. We just head right back in. I think that was the only 882 door in the game. Probably. Oh, there we go. Perfect. 100 eggs. Okay, yeah, so, unless there was, like, any other, uh, 882 doors in the game that are now open, I think we're good to just finally go inside Grunty's mouth and, uh, oh, wait, what is this one? Oh, this is 846, oh, that's weird. Okay. Well, I, I would hope that 66 feathers are enough, so... Let's go ahead and head on in. The final no, <laughs> the final no door to game. All right. I'm gonna assume that this probably leads directly to the boss. Let's go. Defeat Ganon. I mean Grunty. Oh. Ah, there's a final note. There's the final puzzle piece door. Got it. Twenty? That's a lot. <laughs> it's not over, foolish pair. See this big oak door right there? Or here? Many ziggies you will need if you ever will succeed. Yeah, I mean I've definitely succeeded, but dang man. To only have three ziggies left over. That's insane. Especially since you're able to get the uh you're able to spend some ziggies on that empty honeycomb upgrade like for the for the double health before this so it's like man i, I hope you got all but three jickies up to this point you open up the door but then you'll stop the king of hyrule won't let you atop Okay, that rhyme was a little bit weird, but okay. The King of Hyrule? What? 
aren't aren't you the ruler of Hyrule at this point? So suddenly be like the queen of Hyrule? We have the spiral staircase from uh from Ocarina of Time. That's really funny. Do you notice how I say things are really funny without actually laughing at them? Yeah, me too. Why do I feel like there's something down here? Hold on. Give me a second. Hmm. I feel like that would have been the perfect place to hide something. Oh, we can kind of hear the uh, Grunty's theme in the background. Yeah, the uh, the theme of Grunty's Lair in the background. Oh, that's that that that's cool. Oh, and is that Hyrule Castle theme as well? Oh my god. Dude, the music in this game is so good. I cannot even believe it. It's like a soft mix of both Grunty's uh, lair theme and the Hyrule Castle theme. Well, I mean, I have max feathers. I, I keep expecting to see something outside the window. You can shoot arrows! You can throw a bomb! This quest that you're on. I hope your fighting is better than your uh, rhyming skills, Grunty, because uh, that one wasn't very good. Here are the doors that I thought that you can only gold feather. And they, even the creator was like, uh, I didn't even know that you could gold feather these, the, these doors open. Oh, here it is! The red carpet! The red carpet in, until uh, we get to Ganon. I'm trying to let the- I'm trying to let the build up. Uh, go slowly. And also I'm just trying to like, enjoy the music a little bit. Whoa, <laughs> a little bit of a camera shenanigans are going on there. Knock knock, it's Banzo Kazooie. The character, the, the dynamic duo who won't get a game, so fans have to make one for them. Even though people seem to like universally love their games, Microsoft is still like, eh. We're not going to make one. <sighs> Astro Distant, there's Dingpot. Oh, and a golden... What is it? A red and... A red feather and blue egg refill. Wow. That's very generous. Especially since we just collected all those feathers and eggs on the way up here. <laughs> like... What was the point of that, you know? I don't even need these, but I, I want to get them anyway. I did not think that you could have these in two different places. Alright, if you two are done, can we actually get on with this? Alright, what's up, Dingpot? Why are you in Grunty's seat? Dingpot, King of Hyrule. Neil, peasants. Oh my god, he's a king. You? King? Don't make me laugh, sewer breath. I bet Grunktilda's got you right under her warty thumb. Er. What are you waiting for, you stupid pot? 
Attack those two with soup. That's hot. Sorry, mistress, but Dingpot's not having it. Not have any attack animations. I called you king to get you out of the way. But you messed it all up. A price you will pay. Isn't she awful, Dingpot? You should help us take her out. We'll, uh, call you king if you do. Yeah, Dingpot wants to be king. Jump in and Dingpot will fire you to top. Yeah, on second thoughts. Grunty, you can keep Hyrule. Come on, Kazooie. You'll get to kick her butts again. I, I suppose I do deserve a reward after slogging through this mod. All right, let's go. <laughs> we, we got a little bit meta there, I see. <laughs> Oh man, I don't know why that's funny, just having the characters. I cannot believe that Dingpot is... Dingpot is a king, and she wanted him to, to dump soup on us. Alright, that's really funny. Somebody make Dingpot have attack animation so we can fight Dingpot for real. Did I tell you she puked in me? It was awful. Oh, Dingpot, no. Come on. I was literally just a second away from about to jump inside you. You know what, Kazooie's right. Grunty, Grunty can have Hyrule, I'm out of here. This is Link's job anyway. Alright, let's go ahead and do it. Alright, here we go. Oh, I hope my throat can take this. You lousy losers must have cheated. There's no way my castle was defeated. But now that you two have crawled up here, from time I'll make you disappear. Whoa, there's lava here! There's lava in the middle of the stage? You can't do that. That's so... Now I'll knock you through the floor. You can't have lava here. That's insane. Do you even have a brain? I'm gonna, like, stay over here. What do you got? One more? Oh, one more, okay. No, I wasn't slow, I just hey your magic spells are homing. Get him now to stop his roaming. Can I do this? Got it. Now watch me set things up a gear. Okay, we got this. Oh, what? Whoa, I did not want to do that. Wait, why can't I hit her? There we go. I can't dodge with all this weight. Those nasty eggs, I sure do hate. Oh, I got hit. There's lava on outside, too. There we go. It's like, her, her hitbox is a little bit weird because... I don't know, because like I, I'm much higher up on the platform.
There we go. One more time. Oh my god, I just ran right into that lava. Wow! Three sods! I'll beat your butt, don't even try! Quick, use this flight pad to get up there! Teach her a lesson! Alright, here we go. So it's a tough part now. Another hit, I'm getting weak. I really need to take a leak. <laughs> what? I didn't say that. Just a little bit right there. That's okay. Okay. Somehow I missed that, but okay. Yeah, this last hit's always going to be a little bit difficult. I was holding left there. Hey, nice. Oh, one more hit, though? I may be old and rather wide, but well, underneath the shield I'll hide. I don't think I can do anything to her right now. For setting us free, we Jinzos have come to help our friend Banzo. I hid you well for being bad. Don't help the bear. You'll make me mad. How many times are I gonna hit this? Okay. Hey, that Zinzo really hurts. I'll now rub you in the dirt. My voice is getting really quite hoarse. I hope that we get done with this course. Uh, duck and weave. Dude, I'm hitting it. Wow, I hit it once on all that, okay. Okay. I, I cannot hit this. Oh, great. Did this, like, bug out or something? Yeah, I, I gotta restart this fight. I, I... Not only am I about to die, but this... Yeah, the, the statue bugged out on me. Oh, nice! That was only, what, two?
That last thought I failed to stop. So down onto the ground, I'll drop. Wow, that's that still works. Okay. I am the mighty Gingernator! Activate me! Even with your extra friend, I know you're meeting a nasty end. You might be right. I didn't want to say this, but this fight is like very laggy. that. There we go. That hit me? No. Are you ready this time, birdie thing? Uh, I don't know, I guess so. I'll try to be a lot better now. I'm, I'm just gonna start the fight over. Alright, does... Does Grunty say anything different on the return trip? What do I smell? Oh, that's right. It's Stinky Dingpot, that game you... Flight. Oh, I thought it was gonna be like something but like hell or <laughs> these things are gonna like rhyme with hell or whatever. See, at least now I know. I know there's lava around here. I know there's lava on the side. So I'll, I'll be a lot more careful this time. Here's my magnet spell at last. Run and hide, you won't get past. Don't hit me, that's quite enough. I think you'll find the next bit tough. Well, I should be fine. This, part, this part's not that bad. It's just that the hitbox is, like, kind of weird. I can just travel along here, honestly. If I... Uh, excuse me? Did I just walk on lava without taking any damage? That was kind of cool. Okay, there we go, that was a good one. Oh... I just realized I never refilled my eggs. Whoops. Oh, oops. I'm not wanting to brag or boast, but after this, you'll both be toast. Okay, now the fight's for real.
Hey, that was weird. The egg of yours, caught me off guard. Yeah, that was kind of weird. Like, I hit it from behind? Almost? I don't see how that's possible. Oh my god, stop, dude. I'm holding this E button. There we go. See, that one seems normal, but somehow I'm gonna hit it from behind. See, I like, push forward? That's a bit of an anomaly right there. Yeah, that one actually is normal, I feel like. Okay, oh, you got me there. I'm gonna grab this. Okay, flying time again. I <laughs> don't know how I got hit by her, but okay. Can I get this face too fast? Uh, okay. Cut across the sky, it saves my cheeks. Is that enough? Oh uh, yeah, it's enough. I'm, I'm gonna hit her sealed again. Oh no, I'm not. Okay, we're in a much better we're in a much better position this time. Uh, see, that's what I'm talking about, the, uh... That is just really obnoxious, like, hitting me in midair like that. I got that one. We're good on that. Oh, nice. That one only took one. The lava's about to come through the floor there. Come on, game. Work with me here. I can, like, fire from a distance or something. You whipped me all around to catch my breath. I'm on the ground. Okay. Last phase. That is slow. <laughs> that is deceptively slow. I'm the mighty Ginginator. Activate me. I really think you ought to run when I be him and spoil your fun. I was too slow on that one. Okay, that one's done. Got that. expect people to do this like I know I haven't played this I haven't fought this boss in a long time but Christ man
Okay. Just run in a circle. Run in a circle. The last one of that. Okay, perfect. Ooh. Well, I want to say we're home free, but I guess I guess not. Wow. Okay. Come on. Oh my god, I was about to die there again. Okay, here we go. The Jinzo Nature. There's no way he'll set my bulk. I want to try and have a sulk. Ultimate Shinzo power! Poor old Grunty set to fall. Upon the spell I'll now call. It didn't even show the animation of doing it. That was, that was kind of weird. Oh my god, it's a castle. It's Grunty's castle. Oh, it's it's right outside the level. It's, it's in the level too. That's... Grr, a stupid developer promised me. Invincible, he said I'd be. Curse you, Kurgo. Curse you, Bottles. Curse you too, Banjo and Kazooie. Now see fantastic credits screen. Maybe with surprise. See you in Banzo Kazooie. Stay at home. Which is actually under a new name. Game by Mark Kirko as. Oh, here we go. I've seen this before. Somebody else did this. Somebody else did this. Um. One of one of those was uh, by uh, by uh, by Jackson, right? Writing a hacking by by nine. Space on Mega 5000. Sound hacking by that's him, Jackson Z13. That's the guy I have uh, played a couple of his Benzo, Benzo Kazooie hacks. I think he did a similar in the credits like this. James and Lee Kirko. The music in this game was. Oh, there is Fappenberger. I was correct. Remember, remember that picture in uh, the Forest Temple where I didn't know if it was Fappenberger? It was. It was Fappenberger. The funniest of names. Yeah, the music in this game was fantastic. The way that they combined a lot of the uh, Zelda and Banzo Kazooie uh, songs. How, how do you even come up with them like that? Like, and make it sound that good. All the testers. Yeah, this this game is really great. I I, I really don't need to get into much about how fantastic this game is, um, because I've already said it throughout the entire game. So. You, you, you know what my thoughts are on the game. Martin Watts. Banzo's Backpack Team. I'm very glad that Banzo's Backpack is still being used. Because I thought for at a point that people just kind of stopped using it. But 
with people like Kirko, uh, it's uh, it's doing pretty good. Oh, it's a Triforce! Oh man, we finally here. We're at the Triforce. Kirko mods, thanks for playing. Well, thank you for make. Thank you for making. I greatly appreciate it, and I greatly appreciate uh, everybody who who uh, who watched this. And uh, yeah, I just love going in this game blind because it just blew me away so many different other times. It was just amazing, really. Oh wait, can I can I collect, can I collect a Triforce? My one wish is for Banjo Kazooie games to get revived. <laughs> You must have cheated. It's not fair. The Triforce goes to the ugly bear. Wow, Kazooie. We got the Triforce. This is even better than that ice key. Meh. You've seen one gold shiny thing. You've seen them all. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. The Triforce will grant any wish to the mortals who obtain it. Gosh. Well, how about... You get us out of this moronic mod and put us in a real, new HD game? Very well, your wish shall be granted. Woohoo! As uh, soon as Rare gets around to it, it should only be a couple decades or so. Do <laughs> They. They. He did the joke for me. He did the joke for me. I don't. I didn't have to do anything. He did the joke. Oh man! As soon as rare, rare gets around to it. Oh, wow. Yeah, there I am with one health. <laughs> Benzo Kazooie, not looking too happy with me. Okay, yeah, that's, uh, I think that's it for everything, right? Mm-hmm. High roll 10 out of 10. Lost Wood 6 out of 6. Game totals 900, 100, and 24. Only took me a little under 18 hours to beat. And that was a lot of uh, me off screen just looking for stuff. So that was a lot of off screen search, uh, search time. But yeah, uh, the game that Mark Kirko is actually currently working on, it's not called Bendo because if we stay at home, or maybe, maybe maybe the one he was working on was called that, but it's it's been, it's been renamed to Nostalgia 64. Where it's gonna be like a Banjo Kazooie hack that uh, goes to the worlds of different Nintendo 64 games. So, yeah, uh, I have no idea when that game is gonna be released, but I am definitely looking forward to playing it because it looks really awesome from what we've from like the very few things of it we've seen. So, yeah, uh, I can't wait to actually get to that game and. Uh, thanks again to Mark Kirko for making this game, and thanks everybody for watching. I'll see you guys for something else.